after victories in 1984 and 2000, France are hoping for their third European crown. Two years of friendlies have shown the team to be more than capable of dominating Romania, Albania and Switzerland in the first round. The real challenge could come in the semi-finals, where they could face Germany or Belgium. I think we have the ability to go far. When a team are playing at home during a big competition, of course they want to win. France are 17th in the FIFA rankings and have a solid offensive line with the likes of Atletico Madrid's Antoine Griezmann and Arsenal's Olivier Giroud. In midfield, all eyes are on Juventus star Paul Pogba. I'm not expecting him to score two or three goals in each game. That's not how it works. He might score some. He can be better, but he's playing as part of a team. For someone who's got lots of strengths, it's normal to expect a lot. Now all France have to do is ignore tabloid scandals and close the gaps in their defensive line after losing key players to injury, including Lassana Diara in midfield and staple defenders Raphael Varane and Jérémy Mathieu. It's troubling to lose players, of course, but, well, that's not a reason to say we're going to start the competition saying we'll just do what we can. No, we have to do everything to go as far as possible to stay ambitious. The semi-finals are a reasonable goal for France, who made it to the quarter-finals of the 2014 World Cup. Even better, lifting the trophy at the Stade de France on July 10th.